We are the Clean Edge Razor Case Response Team, Group D. Our team members are Karen Alexander, Sarah Deasonroth, John Hughes, Christopher Lair, Michael Porcelli, Michael Sweeney, and Daniel Thompson. Group C opted for an initial launch in the niche market with a follow-on launch in the mainstream markets in year two. They also elected to remove their Paramount brand from any association with the product and reduce their advertising budget. As a group, we agree with the launch timeline. Starting in the niche market allows a soft launch prior to the mainstream entry that can build reputation to aid in future sales. However, we feel using the Paramount name will be key in bringing in customers who trust the name. Additionally, in an effort to constrict further market share erosion, we intend to remain aggressive with the marketing budget for the Pro and Avail products, with the ultimate goal to release a new Pro model in 2012. The strategy is not without risk. There is a strong chance that another brand could develop a similar technology and beat us to the mainstream market. We also believe that not using the Paramount name, like Group C suggested, ignores the potential value gains from brand recognition. We feel our current market share with the Pro and Avail products are subject to continued erosion if our course of action included a decrease in advertising budget and no plans to revamp the product line. To mitigate these risks, we feel that we need to ensure the Paramount brand is tied to the product and that we overemphasize the successful clinical trials. By doing so, we ensure that we both leverage the Paramount brand equity and produce a strong and compelling case that this razor is the most technologically advanced razor and best razor to come to market to date. Further, by increasing the advertising budget and directly, directly targeting cost consumers consuming competitor goods in the moderate and value segment, we can bring new customers into our lower end razors that will mitigate the cannibalization risks. This will allow us an additional year while we revamp and launch an updated pro product with intentions to hit shelves in 2012. Clean Edge is the most advanced razor on the market technologically and is clinically proven to outperform the competition. Most of the growth in the razor market is attributed to new technologies and new product releases. Clean Edge uses vibrating technology to stimulate hair follicles to give a closer shave than the competition. Research indicates that men find it to be the closest, cleanest, smoothest shave they have ever experienced. The five blade ultra thin technology gets that close shave while reducing skin irritations. Designed with a large handle, the, the user can get a superior grip to improve control, adding to the overall experience. During an 18 month clinical test, and consumer research period, Paramount found that it achieved 25% increase in hair removal. From the research, the Clean Edge razor improves skin condition, gives a more even skin tone, and improve, improves skin texture. Our strategy is to keep the Paramount name associated with Clean Edge. Paramount has strong brand recognition through its other non-disposable razors, specifically the Paramount Pro. Accounting for 23.3% of the market, it is still a market leader in the non-disposable razor segment. In an interest to attract new customers associated with the brand Clean Edge with the established brand Paramount gives credibility to the brand. If Paramount were trying to create a cheaper brand, it may not want to associate itself with an even more low-tech product. Since Clean Edge is moving into a more high-tech segment, Paramount can also increase its own brand awareness by associating the company with, the constant, innov with constant innovation within the non-disposable razor segment. Lastly, since majority of the distribution channel lies with, with mass market retailers and food and drug stores, it benefits Clean Edge to be associated with Paramount. It also gives Paramount a well-positioned group of products for all desires of function within the segment. Market strategy differentiators are the piggyback approach for clean edge product into the market space leveraging the Paramount name. This can be used as a defense system to avoid being lost in the crowd on the packed shelves of retail stores. Running with just the clean edge name puts the brand in jeopardy of being a small fish in a big pond. 
The advertising budget will be consistent year over year and possibly increase to attract more market share. The increased budget will allow for new products to be campaigned effectively and efficiently. Using the clinical trial as a springboard prior to launch will provide customers with firsthand testimonials of their, of their experiences. Customer feedback from the testimonials will give us, an opportun will give us any, any opportunities to tweak our message prior to launch. Utilizing the Paramount name allows for better customer relations, increased trend exposure, and increased market feedback through the Paramount footprint. In 2011, the launch year of the Clean Edge Razor by Paramount, we are anticipating that 35% of the sales will be from customers who have purchased the Pro Avail razors and cartridges. In an effort to stabilize the cannibalization of our product line, we will be implementing a target marketing strategy with emphasis on attracting new customers currently utilizing competitive brands to our razors. The goal would be to focus more on switching customers from competing brands and the Pro and Avail segments by offering coupons, trials on our website giving out free Pro and Avail razors by signing up, and offering refunds by to competing brand loyalists who tried our products unsuccessfully. To do so, we will increase the dollar spend in 2011 in promotions. We believe this will allow us to recoup an additional 5% of revenue to the Pro and Avail product line. Our company position is not to let Clean Edge retire our other two key products, rather stabilize the eroding market share and release a new pro product in 2012. This will allow us to have three innovative and successful products spanning all three market segments. Factoring in a rollout strategy that will position the Clean Edge razor in the niche market for two years and transition to the mainstream market thereafter, the following forecasts have been provided for gross revenue. 2009 shows the gross revenue earned on the Pro Avail product lines will reach $170 million. Total cost of goods was $78 million, and total advertising promotion expenses were $66 million, resulting in a net profit of $26 million. Currently, in 2010, we are expecting to see a 1.1% decrease in overall market share in the Pro and Avail product lines. This will have an unfavorable impact to gross revenue of about $8.1 million and a favorable impact on cost of goods of about $3.7 million year over year. In this year, it is important to note that the advertising and promotion budget was requested to be reduced to $48.3 million, projecting a net revenue of $39.3 million in 2010. The decline in market share is important to notate because in order to forecast revenue for the first two years of the launch of the Clean Edge, in years 2011 and 12, we expect some of the sales to come at the expense of top line revenue for our current pro and avail product line. In fact, we are estimating that in 2011 we will see a 35% reduction in top line revenue from the pro and avail product lines from volume going to the new clean edge product. In order to stabilize and hold off that level of erosion, we believe by increasing our advertising expenses on the pro and avail product lines by $6 million and implementing a target consumer promotion towards customers of competing products, we will be able to recoup 5% of that projected erosion. This will give us a total gross revenue in 2011 of just over $200 million. The erosion of roughly 30% will have a favorable impact of $22 million to the cost of goods for the pro and avail product line which will help offset some of the increases to marketing for the launch of the Clean Edge product. This will allow us to yield a net revenue of 62.7 million. Moving on to 2012, we intend to release an upgraded Pro product to further recover our lost market share in the moderate market segment. This refreshed Pro product will allow us to outpace the forecasted industry growth of 5% and add 10% to our top line. Factoring in a modest 5% growth in the Clean Edge product, we are forecasting gross revenues of about 216 million in 2012, an overall 8% increase year over year. The increase in sales for all product lines will have an unfavorable impact to cost of goods of about 9 million, and we believe we will keep the marketing budget consistent from the prior year in order to appropriately get the word out on the newly redesigned Pro product. 
In 2013 and 2014, we shift our strategy to a mainstream approach, leveraging the brand equity and market share acquired in the prior two years under our niche strategy. The move to the mainstream approach will drive increases to cost of goods due to significant volume increases. Increases to cost of goods over these two years will be $29 million compared to the niche campaign. We anticipate that the pro product will grow top line revenue at 15% and Clean Edge will reap the largest reward from the migration to the mainstream market with 25% growth year over year. Top line revenue is forecasted at 258 million, roughly 19% increase from 2012. 2014 will show a significant increase in cartridges for the Clean Edge product line. That, coupled with 5% growth in the Pro Avail, will show a top line revenue of $318 million. The increase in cartridge sales will have an unfavorable increase to cost of goods, while the advertising dollars will remain constant year over year, further solidifying our grasp as a top producer and retailer of cartridges and razors. Net income is projected to be just over $88 million in 2014. We believe this strategy gives Paramount the best opportunity to successfully launch an innovative product and secure their spot as a top producer of razors and cartridges. Thank you.